Here, I'm gonna show you an easy trick for getting the custom number formatting codes for Excel. So let us right click this number, go to Format Cells, and Number Tab down to Custom. We have many number format codes here that control how this number is going to look. If we look to the sample section up here, we can see that it changes when I select these options. And these are the codes that I'm talking about. And there are many of these codes. However, this does not encompass the full range of things that you can do as far as formatting is concerned. We have many other things up here that we can do. But if we add these formatting options here, that's great and simple to do by hand. But then how do we get the code for that so we can use it in a formula, a function, or in VBA so that we can automatically format text? Well, there's a nice, neat little trick for that. You go over here to whichever category you want. Let's go with currency and you get the options looking how you want it to look. Then we can hit OK. Make sure everything looks good here. And we then go back to that window. So right click format cells or just click it and go to this guy right here. And then go back to the custom tab and it has added our format to the bottom of the list. So if it's not already in this list, it will add it and then it's going to select that so that we can then go into this type section right here. We can copy it, close this window, and use it however we want to use it. In this case, in the text function, quote, paste, quote, close it up. And it's as easy as that. So get the formatting how you want it to be. Then go to the format cells window, number tab, custom, and the option you've applied is going to be selected here. If it isn't on here by default, it's going to be added at the end. And for all the ones that have been added, you can click them and hit delete to remove it from this list. And this is especially helpful with dates. So you'll notice I have a date right here. We can go to a date. And let's say that we do not want to use English US, let's use English United Kingdom. And maybe make the date like this and hit OK. And then we can go back to that window, custom, and there we go at the bottom, the code for that. This is going to save you a lot of headaches and a lot of time so that you don't have to learn how to make all the custom number formatting codes from scratch. If you like this tip, make sure to give this video a thumbs up, subscribe, and hit the bell icon to get all my tutorials. And check out the links below this video to see my full Excel courses. That'll take you from beginner to expert and help you streamline all of your work in Excel.